PDF is a great file type. It allows you to transfer documents pretty much anywhere in the world, and whoever is receiving it can open it up in an application and read it. When you want to edit them, however, it can be more challenging, especially if you're going to use Google Docs. So how can we convert a PDF to a Google Doc, edit it in Google Docs, and then export it back to a PDF? Well, if you hang around, I will show you everything you need to know about converting and working with PDFs and Google Docs. Okay, so I have this old media kit here on my desktop, and this isn't something that I use anymore, but it's a PDF, and so I want to open this up in Google Docs. Okay, so here we are in Google Docs, and I will let you know right off the bat that sometimes you can convert PDFs directly to a Google Doc right here in Google Docs without using any other application, and sometimes you can't. And the big factor that determines whether you can or can't is whether or not your PDF has images in it. If it's strictly text, you'll be able to convert it right away and edit it. If it has images, Google Docs, Google Drive doesn't do the best at bringing in those images. You're going to have to use a third-party program, but I'm going to use one that's trusted and that's Free. So hopefully that will uh, give you a little bit of a better peace of mind. Uh, but let's take a look at just bringing this PDF in as is. To do that, first I want to show you what this PDF looks like. So let's go ahead and let's minimize this real quick. And let's just open this PDF up in preview. You'll notice that it has text, you know, in quite a bit of it. It has images, image at the top there, an image here. And then there's also like a little bit of a table here. Uh, again, this is all old. I haven't even looked at this to, to see if it's relevant to my current pricing. So don't think that, that this is what it is. But uh, you can see it has pretty much all aspects of a PDF that PDFs often have. So it's a good example to use. So let's close this out and let's go back into Google Drive. Okay, so from within Google Drive, we're just going to click on New and we're going to click on File Upload. And we're just going to upload this PDF directly. So we'll just select it from the desktop. And again, this is the same for Windows or Mac users. I'm obviously on a Mac, but this will work the same. It's actually going to be easier uh, for Windows users. And I'll tell you that uh, a little bit later on. That's actually the same, but it might be easier for Windows users. So I've already uploaded this before, but I'm just going to, uh, we'll just say keep both. So we upload a new version so you can, you can see that. I've uploaded this a bunch. I use this as examples. So let's go to recent. So we'll go to recent since we just uploaded it. And here we go. We have this old media kit. It's got the two that we uploaded at 12.51 p.m. That too will help us, you know, determine that this is the, the new version that we're working with. So if we just click to open this up, it opens it up in Google Docs or Google Drive's PDF viewer. So we can view it and everything's there. It looks the same as it did. It is the same. It's still a PDF. We're just viewing it in a different program. Okay, so that's great. But I want to edit this. And obviously from here, I can't edit it. So what I can try and do is I can go up here to the top and I can click this open with Google Docs link. Alternatively, we could have just right clicked on it and gone to open with and clicked Google Docs as well. So multiple ways, same result. So now Google Docs tries to convert it and it does convert some of it. You'll notice that we have all of the text converted. So I could go in here and I could, you know, change the text. However, we didn't get any of the images. There were quite a few images, you know, I just showed you. Uh, let's see if we can pull it up here on the desktop. We'll just use the spacebar preview. I mean, it didn't get this image at all. It didn't get any of the images. If we scroll down, you'll notice this is it. This is it right here because none of these images came in. So that is obviously an issue. Now I could, there are multiple ways to solve this. I could, you know, command shift four on my Mac or uh, snipping tool on Windows and I could screenshot these images and stuff like that. But I don't, that's not what I would recommend. That's just an option if you're in like a dire situation. So if you want to bring this PDF into Google Drive or Google Docs and actually edit it with the images, you need to convert it first. And the easiest way to do that is to actually convert it to a DOCX. So this is why I said it might be easier for Windows users. But don't worry, Mac users, I have a solution. You're not going to have to buy Word. Don't worry. So for Windows users, you should be able to go into Microsoft Word and then go ahead and open up the PDF that you would like to convert. And then you should be able to go to the file menu and hit export as or convert and just convert it to a docx. Uh, I'm gonna show you another way to do that. So I'm going to assume that you can figure that out in Word. If not, you can follow this other method as well. So the other method is to use Adobe. Uh, so if I open up this other window I have here in Chrome, you'll notice that I'm at adobe.com forward slash acrobat forward slash online forward slash PDF to word.html. You can see it there. I'll put a link to this in the description so you can just click on that. It'll make it a little bit easier. And this is actually a free tool by Adobe. So this is an online version of Adobe Acrobat. And yes, there's a paid version for Acrobat, uh, but this isn't the paid version. This is just a free conversion tool. And I found this by kind of going to the Acrobat page just to show you. And if you scroll all the way down, they have 
this uh, area where it says try these Acrobat online tools and one of them is PDF to Word. So if you're trying to convert PDF to something else, you could use that as well. Like you could convert it to Excel and then bring it into Google Sheets, okay? So there's a bunch of cool tools here. Again, I'll put the link in the description and this works great. So we'll just select our file and we'll choose the old media kit that we have on the desktop. We'll open it up in Adobe Acrobat Online and you can see it says the file is ready and I can sign in to download it for free. Uh, so you do have to sign in, but you don't have to pay anything. So I just sign in with my Google account that I'm using. And this is the first time I've used it on this account. So I actually didn't know you had to do this. So it's just creating me a new free account right now. You might have to do this too. So I'm kind of glad it came in the video. Okay, so now we're signed into this Adobe Acrobat Online. We can, you know, we don't have to do the tour or anything. If you look down, this is kind of like, it kind of functions like Google Drive, but you'll notice that we have this old media kit .docx, okay? So it has converted it to Microsoft Word. We're not even gonna check the steps. I could open it now and see if the docx looks good, but I, I'm pretty confident that it is. So what we're going to do is we're going to click on the three dots over here to the right, and we're going to download it. And so you'll notice it kind of is downloading up here. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go back into Google Drive. So that's the other tab I have open here or window. We're going to close out this document. And we're going to upload the new docx format. So we go to new, we're going to go to file upload. This time I'm going to go to my downloads folder. And you'll notice that I have old media kit docx. That's the one we want. Let's open that up. So you can see it's right here. You notice that it has the W symbol because it's in word format. So let's open it up. This is kind of like the moment of truth. Ta-da. And here we are. Now it's still in docx. I know, but don't worry. So we can edit it right now. Okay. Cause you can edit docx documents in Google drive, Google docs. So I could, you know, delete this picture or undo that. And I can edit all the text, all that I want. So it is completely editable. Now, if I do want to actually edit this, not just in Google docs, the application, but in Google docs format, we can do that. We can just go up here to the file menu and we can go to save as Google docs. It will open up a new tab and you'll notice this one has dot docx. Now we have old media kit and this everyone. This is Google docs format and we've got our images. We scroll down, we have all the images in here. We used the Adobe free, Adobe Acrobat free online. So now how do we go the other way around? How do we take this back to a PDF? Uh, so this one, this part is easy and you don't have to use another tool. We're in Google Drive, Google Docs. We made our changes. Let's say we changed some images, changed some text, updated things. Now we can just go to file and we can go to download and then where it says download, you could download it as any of these file formats, but obviously we want PDF. So let's download it as a PDF. And you'll notice that here it is, uh, it should be down in my downloads folder. And we have this PDF that we just re-downloaded. This was the original one. We converted it to docx. We brought it into Google docs. We converted it to Google docs, and then we exported it back as a PDF all for free using online tools, did not have to download any software. So this is how you can work with PDFs and Google docs. I wish I didn't have to give you that intermediary step of using docx format, but that is what works best. And it's really an easy trusted way to do it. So you just have to use Google Drive and either Acrobat or Word, three very trusted and reliable tools. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, I would really appreciate a thumbs up here on YouTube. If you wanna see more technology tips and tutorials, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. That's all I have for you for today. This is Anson from AnsonAlex.com.